Oh, I can turn the I can turn the Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. I know you like that. How the kids do? You're on purpose, baby. Hey. Come on, the sir. Oh, you know what to worry about. What's that on y'all, <laughs> man? You know what I'm saying? It's been a minute, huh? It's been a minute. Yeah, for sure. Listen, we back now. We back. And we about to be back like we never left. You know what I mean? Never left. Back on our bullshit. Mm. You know what I mean? So today is just me. And my guy T underscore T Hills, follow me for more life advice. You, you know did? what I'm saying? Together we gonna do the Root it! show. Yeah! And we bring this bitch to your front door. You, know you did. So look, what you been up to, bro? Man, uh, well you see the background a little different. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, uh, so bought a house. I- yeah, you know I mean, bought a house. Uh, major move. Major move. Yeah, I get where they get lost. Hey. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey. But uh, yeah, hey, like, man, you know, that's, hey. that was my biggest move. Uh, biggest move, yeah, buying a house, bro. You know what I'm saying? I, like I said, I don't think too many people understand what come with it, and you never really truly understand what come with it until you in it. You yeah. know, so yeah, yeah. So like, I, I bought a home. You know what I'm saying? We have a nice new background. We, it's gonna continue to evolve for y'all. Oh, this God. is the pod room. You know what I mean? What about you, man? I did that too. You bought another home? Cause last time I checked, you was already a homeowner. Something like that. Okay. I, real investment, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Got a little partner. We make this shit happen. Okay. Make what, a move. What you doing? What you bought the home for? Are we, it's, it's out there in Gonzalez. We got a little Airbnb property, you know what I mean? Booming. Business booming. You know what I'm saying? Been in, it's, been on, it's been on the market for about a uh, month and a half, mm-hmm. almost two months. And we, I didn't make like 10K off of it. Damn. But uh, no, no, no. That's just the income. That's not including the... Um, Expenses and everything. Expensive. Oh, so that's revenue. That's a, yeah. Okay. Okay. But revenue. still, but the money moving. So that's all that matter. You know what I mean? Right. I ain't gonna. I ain't gonna have y'all all up in my business and telling you what I'm. Yeah. But just know, it's moving. You know what I mean? That's what's up. That was up. So like, man, like speaking of like homes and everything else like that, getting into it because I know we kind of late with it, but let's go into it and give the people kind of your take on the whole Diddy situation right now as it has. You know what I'm saying? As it is right now. We didn't talk about it when it broke. We didn't talk about it when they uh, raided this house for the baby all and all this other stuff. When the story started coming out. But now that we have kind of a full take of it, what is your take on it? Man, listen. I don't be up in them, up in them folks' business like that. You know what I mean? I see what I see on that. And I, got, I don't know if it's real or if it's fake, the baby all shit. I don't know. Was that shit real or was it the baby? Fake? Yeah, they said the baby oil was real. Now they're trying to say that uh, they found some kind of drug inside of the baby oil. Oh my god! Allegedly, because yeah, I mean, to me he's the, innocent to proven guilty. Tab, the tab, the cell been tampered with. You know I mean? The mm. cell been tampered with. Listen, if that man is thinking like that, he's a wild boy. Oh, but it's a lot of you wild motherfuckers out there. You know what I'm saying? He just happened to get popped. Mm. I ain't justifying what he's doing, but. You know, if it's consensual, do what you do. Would you go to a Diddy freak off? A freak off? Yeah. Man, listen. Or a Diddy party with the label? Listen, I, 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 didn't, I didn't did some shit. You know, and I'll go to that bitch, you know, as long as there ain't no weird shit happen around me. <laughs> and I'll be in that bitch sliding. You hear me? Whoa. Oh, God. Baby, what, I, what about, like, the stories we hear, like, about allegedly of... Uh, he, uh, him wanting to uh, Tupac to mess with uh, rest in peace, Miss Porter. You know what I'm saying? The mother of his children. Rest in peace to both of them. Yeah, rest in peace to both of them. For real, Pac and Miss Porter. And Niggas he wanted to see win. which one she liked better. Like stories like that starting to come out. Niggas. Stories, you know what I'm saying? Stories of him beating her on a boat and then having a doctor come fix her nose out there and stuff like that. Like that shit ain't surprising, man. You, you, I saw the Cassie video. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. at the same time. Like people go through extreme lengths to uh, to maintain a lifestyle, mm. in my opinion. You know what I mean? Some some of that shit, everybody can just leave. At any given time, you might have to shit may not be how you want it to be, but if you really want to leave, you can leave. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So as far as that situation, um how I feel about the that that situation, nigga is weird, bro. It's just weird. So. Yeah. But he not the first. It's, is it? He's not the first, bro. But is it weird? Like, just say that, all right. 
I'm a, I'm a multi, multi, multi millionaire. Yeah. Right now, we can say a billionaire. Yeah. And I want, and I like to have certain parties to, you know, where a lot of people are getting it in. That's cool. You know what I mean? I, I would attend the party, but as long as everything consensual, you know what I'm saying? But, but just the other, other half of it, right? Yeah. The Kim Porter and Tupac. Why you want somebody else to smash your woman to see? But the same thing with Cassie in her, uh, you know, what I'm saying in her papers too, where she was saying that you know they were, you know, he would have well endowed men come and you know, raw, yeah, raw out in front of him. He'll just sit there and watch. And that's I guess, how he'll get I off. guess it's no, I guess it's no different than watching a, a porno. You might know because you know it's I, a lie. No, I don't want no porno nigga hitting my woman. Hey, that's hey, son, that's. That's what he liked. Man, they don't like. Man, maybe, no homo, maybe, but they built for that. I, I can't. Maybe he couldn't hit the back of that bitch and he wanted to see how she act when a nigga hit the back of that bitch. Man, them niggas hitting the back of that bitch and pushing the back. Hey, I'm going to let you know, I ain't got all that type of dick. Listen. I'm going to let you know. Yeah. <laughs> this bitch right. Ain't no, I, hey, I don't mind going on camera for myself, but you talking about going on camera for the world? Oh, hell no, nah, man. I, I, don't ain't, I ain't got me. that. I don't care me. I ain't got that. I don't care. Hey, hey. I don't count. Hey, hey, man. Hey, I man. Listen, listen. <laughs> I don't count. I don't care who looking. I don't care about none of that shit. You heard me? If it's me and you, we locked in. We can do the. We can do it on the front of the car. You heard me? Mm. I didn't did that already. I can't. I, don't get me wrong, bro. I, I'm cool with going on my personal phone and her, or her personal phone. Show your friends. Let me show my friends. Listen, bro. I did that shit. I can't take it back. Right, but like, son, son, I'm talking about you want a porn star nigga. You know what I'm saying, man, man, yeah, yeah, long man. And he hitting your one, bro. We I watched, even... we watched the uh the shit. What what is his name? Adam Twenty Two. Yeah, and, and, and his girl. Yeah, man, I don't see how he recovered from that one. Hey, what she, she loved him. She said, she said, she was so she couldn't give him pussy for like yeah for a minute for at least a week or so. Bro, come on, bro. Man, come on, bro. Hey. If you go cheat, bitch, at least let me, at least uh, have enough decency to come home so I can me, stick it in for five minutes. If you ain't gonna give me some pussy, you're gonna give me something. Oh, Lord. Yeah, hey, I'm leaving with something. You hear know I me? Mean? Add hey, hey, some out, huh? <laughs> Listen. Listen. Hey. hey, all I do is, bro, I couldn't, I, I couldn't allow another man to come. Like, I, I wouldn't mind you hitting something that I got off to the side. You feel know what I'm saying? If it was like that, but I'm not, I, I cannot let you come in and hit and hit my main. You ruining my home. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Right, some niggas into weird shit, bro. Yeah, yeah. You, it's just a complex you have. Some niggas don't have that same complex. Yeah, but some don't care. I don't care about. Like a, me, I'm getting that right now, bro. I don't, it's a lot of shit that I don't understand, bro. bro. Mm. A lot. Right. Oh, so you saying you allow your Joan to cheat on you if, if you don't know? Listen, I'm, I'm coming to the realization that people are going to do what they want to do. Oh. You know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to make you do nothing that you don't want to do. Right? You can sign up for the program and fuck with me. As long as you keep it silent, as long as you don't have me out here looking stupid. And you run your routes, whatever you run your routes, and your routes never get back to me or my, you know, my circle. I don't really give a fuck. Mm. I don't care. Is that it, and as long as it don't interfere with what I'm trying. To do. But is that a way for you to say you giving yourself an out to go do the same thing? Uh, yeah. <laughs> See, okay. now we get to the root of the tree. I mean, uh, like, have you ever? Have, Realistically, bro, we're not gonna desire only each other forever. Mm. Like, there's gonna be other desires out there. There's gonna be points in, in in a situation where you you really don't want to deal with me, and I really don't want to deal with you. But it, it's kind of funny, though, right? Right. Like, it's hard to to keep doing the same thing with the same person. Yeah. Like, yeah. Like you can you can go three rounds with your girl or two rounds with your girl, right? Mm -hmm. Shit, shit goes soft. Right? Uh -huh. And you up in there trying to must up the courage to get back in. But let another bitch come walk up in there. Oh, I'm going, yeah, hell yeah. Both of y'all? It, it, it ain't even going to be no, no thought of it. No huh? thought. It's just going to do what it do. Right. 
you know, unless unless you're too excited to work work against you, and you know, <laughs> don't, don't do it. But you know, like I can I can have sex with my girl three times. Yeah. They leave out they leave out the house. Dick so I see this motherfucker right here. Still gonna try to hit. Man, listen. The dick gonna get hard. Yeah. I ain't even gotta do nothing. I was struggling inside after two hours. Yeah. She walk in the door, I'm like, ooh, I need that. I, not really, I need that. You know what I'm saying? If, for me, what I be saying in my head, oh, I feel like. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's just a feel, like, you know what I'm saying? And then most of the time, I don't know about you, but in my head, I just be going to hit it from the back. Like, <laughs> that's it. Yeah, like, for me, my, my that's opinion, it. It's a drug transaction. Yeah. Like, uh, like affairs and shit like that, man. Mm. Like, like, one woman said, it made sense for, for her. Like, she didn't, and she didn't mind that her husband tricked off. You know what I mean? Right. Because he went out there, he paid for, for a prostitute. That means he paid for discretion. Right. That means he paid for a service. Got a service, came home, and was able to pour the rest of his energy into his family when his wife or his girl had her own shit going on. Right. And, and she couldn't service him. So it was like, yeah, but my thing is this, like, if we gonna play it like that, then man, she got somebody servicing her too. Hey, like that's what you was just saying on some straight like long as long as he don't know and she don't know. Yeah. So I I'm gonna take the opposite route. Like, I believe that we can maybe I'm being PC, that we can be together one on one, you know, and just spread it out. Like, yeah, I wanna Right here, but I'm you know the long I wait a little bit, I'm gonna want to tear you up a little bit more because now it's like a build up in me of, oh man, I'm, about, I'm gonna show you you gonna you make me wait these last two days, goddamn, you know, what I mean? like more of a I feel like we spread it out, we we would allow each other to we would allow each other to want each other more, you know what I mean, like make each other miss each other. What you say? I didn't even not sympathize with that. Yeah. You know? To have one woman? Yeah, to like, to think about it, bro. What, to, to, to not be cool with this woman because of her own needs. Right? Yeah. Whether you can't, get, you can't do it or not. It's a little fucked up, but it's selfish. Right? To think oh, about it. Okay, talk to me. Right? If y'all was just friends. Yeah. And y'all was just fucking, it wouldn't matter who she was fucking up. As long as you was, as long as you was. As long as you getting you is pretty much, yeah. Right? Okay. So why should that change? It should change because now we have labels. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like the now it's like you're mine. You know what I'm saying? Especially. That's what I'm saying. The titles. That's all it is. Is a title. It's not. Really, yeah. It's not really like y'all not married. You know what I'm saying? If you're married, then y'all in a a, a, contra- a contractual agreement to do life together. Right. But outside of that, like even if y'all in a contractual agreement to do life together, this is a part of life. To cheat. No, like life happens. Like right. life is is what happens. Right. Okay. People cheat. People don't get certain. People don't like. They don't be fulfilled in their relationship. Right. Like, okay. If you're not fulfilled in your in, in, if you're not fulfilled in your job, you're going to seek to do more. Okay. Right. Okay. So would it be would it would you cheat on your job by going look for another job because you got? You know what I'm saying? No, no. Okay, I see what you're saying, but I'm not. Tell, I'm not going before God also and saying, God, this is the only job I'm going to ever have. And I'm going to ever, you know what I'm saying, X, Y, and Z. We're encouraged, in fact. It, 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 I guess if this goes with your point. We're encouraged to have more than one job or to, you know, to have more to where you can, you know, have more ends meet on the table. Kind of, kind of crazy. Think about it. Yeah. How Jesus got it. Uh, re- uh, remarkable conception. Damn. Still what? Damn, like you. Oh, so you saying Mary cheated on Joseph? No, Joseph had Joseph had to be a true, but he had to deal with life. Hmm. But if, but if you knew she, but she was considered a virgin in the Bible. You don't know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, and, if, if Mary was modern, if Mary, if you, if, today. Oh, I wouldn't believe that. Shit. I wouldn't believe that. Mary told you this in today's day. Yeah, I wouldn't believe it. Right? 
You gonna be stoic? You gonna hold it down? My guy gotta come to me. <laughs> if Mary come to me, sheesh. But if God come to me, oh, this this is my son. You take care of him. Yes, Lord. I got but you. I, but how you gonna know he come to you? Huh? Like, how you gonna know? Maybe I'm asleep. I don't it can't be Mary. I, it, it better be a dream, better be something, because it can't be Mary. If Mary come to me, I'm, and she like, God told me to tell you this, baby. No, no indeed. No, no indeed. Look, the Lord gonna tell him. Yeah, I want to hear the first time he's gonna wake up. Bitch, you pregnant? No, I don't think so. I'm a virgin. She gonna try to turn over. Let me see. Let me see. Hold on. Let me smell it. <laughs> this smell used. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> that's a crown. <laughs> what are you talking about? Let me get in there. Let me feel it. <laughs> Nigga try to end it right then in there. You heard me? Hey, what if you have tried to get matter, into it? Matter of fact, I'm about to go up right up in there. We just say it's Yeah, yeah, man. Come on. Yeah, but hey, but you wouldn't really know until her foot. Uh, she wouldn't get her period, man. That'd be crazy, bro. Crazy. You know what's funny? Thinking about it. Like back then, women got women got their periods, but they didn't have pads back then. So were they just bleeding on their clothes? Why? The urge that they get, the shit just don't come down. You get crabs or something like that. They get an indicator like you got a pee or pool or some shit like that. Mm. The feeling, I guess. Well, I don't know. You got me on that one. I'm, I'm guessing. I don't know. You got to ask, ask woman. Oh, yeah, yeah. She, she's on her way. She's on her way. Well, yeah. So look. Right? I'm done. Now that we got the Diddy shit out of the way, <laughs> right? Let's talk about this uh this interview that uh Cam had with Corey Hope. Oh yeah, I seen that. The shit was hilarious, bro. Very. But since we talking about God and like you said, the Bible is up to up to you know my interpretation. Mm -hmm. Like it's for all of us to read, mm -hmm. but we all don't have to interpret it the same way. True. Right? True. Right. That being said, how you feel about his his thoughts on um on how how Jesus I mean not Jesus how um Adam <laughs> ate the apple. Oh, and how you said that basically uh men should listen to their women all the time. <laughs> I, 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 I'm not gonna say all of the time, but what I'm gonna say is is like I I me personally yeah. I don't agree completely with what he said. Right. But I think that everybody, you shouldn't, just because it's your partner and you value them, you shouldn't listen to everything. You should take heed to everything. That right. Say, I agree. Right. And then evaluate the options together. And then whoever is the head should make the decision. Right. Whether it's you or her, whoever you feel like has a, like, depending on your, your family dynamic or relationship dynamic. Then y'all make the best decision, right? right? A part of being a part of being a great leader to me is knowing is knowing how to follow and when to follow, mm. right? Knowing that hey, I, this is not my strong suit. This is an area that's more suited for this person. Right. I'm gonna defer to you, you, you when it comes to this. But see, that's the thing. In 2024, it's hard to say. As a man, okay, I'm gonna solely make this decision because society makes us feel like, okay, you have to include X, Y, and Z. So, it, and they make us feel that there is no real alpha to the situation. There's only, part, you know, what I'm saying like a a, a, a by partnership. You know, it's what I'm saying? always an alpha. Or a partner, yeah. It's always gonna be the alpha. I, 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 this is gonna be a little fucking sexist, but um, I am gonna say it. The only reason that that people are allowed to do as they please mm -hmm. is because men enforce these rules. Mm -hmm. Explain. Right? If we was living in a without laws, who would stop me from doing anything I, will, I want from a woman? Unless she had... A she, gang of women over her. That's yeah, it. <laughs> but it's a gang of women versus a gang of men. Right. Like, just think about it. If you had, if you had the rank, not saying that you fucked up like that, mm -hmm. but if you grew up, you know what I mean, with the mind that these women are for, are my toy. I do what I can do whatever. You I gonna play? Them, yeah, you right? gonna play? You gonna play? You gonna, and we we like we physically 
stronger than them. We're going to yeah. impose our will on them. No, they would have to outthink us. In order to, they was in an extraordinary situation. Right, they would have to outthink us. Right. Yeah. But I'm not going to say who's the greatest. Think who who mine works better. Right. But it's just that's just in my opinion that's how it is. Okay. If you ask me, the reason that people have the freedom to do as they please is because law because society put laws in place and they are enforced by men. Okay. Okay, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. You're saying that because of that. Okay, so men and women may have the mind to put these laws together, right? Right. But it's because of the enforcement of these rules by the men. By the superior. By the by, okay. By the superior that allows these laws to, that allows us to think and to act and to do right. as these laws entail. Is right. what you're saying. Okay. Because if not, like if there, if there, if there was no reprimand from, for from uh doing what, from breaking the laws, yeah, right, and no one enforced them, then what, what the what the fuck is the law for? Yeah, it it be it would be upon the, the actual like, human to to follow. Like, it's like going to punch on somebody, right? Yeah. Like going to punch on somebody. You can do they, it, and they ain't got no big dog to come punch on you. Okay. You feel what I'm saying? Okay, and that's what like, I was saying. I come to, I come to your house yeah. and I and I, I smack your mama. Right. Hey, there's consequence behind that. Right? The consequence. But but nobody in your house could beat me. Yeah, I but you got free reign. Yeah, but you miss with your stick. Huh? I ain't gonna miss with these three bullets. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I mean by you know, that's what I mean by like in situations like if it wasn't if they if you if I was if I had uh, mm-hmm. physical ability, you know, versus mm-hmm. your physical ability, the, the most dominant person will win. Right, of, of course, right? of course. And if there's no no system that's set in place to protect, protect, right, and reprimand people for not doing these things, right, people will be running around doing just still doing it, doing it, right, the fuck they are. right, regardless of what, right, right. because you you are weak. You would have to like you would have to excel in the mind in the mindset or work as a group. Mm-hmm. But then then again, when you think about it again, like it's always going to be an outsmart thing. You gonna have to outsmart. Yeah, the outsmart the other people. Yeah. Right. Because if they had a village full of women, they're gonna think us. A village full of men, right? Yeah. And everybody has the same resources. What's stopping that village of men from going over that? Kid? And taking over it. Yeah. Take the woman. Take the woman. Take the Take the food, take the provisions, take everything from them. They can do it if they want to. Yeah, primitive, primitively, yes. Yeah. Of course, be, be, primitively speaking, yeah. So I agree. That's, that's just my thought on it, on how that works. Yeah, but see, my thing on it was, like, for him, like, I, I agree with you, and, and, and I agree with him on some things, not all things, because, like, but what I loved about, let me just go about the interview. What I loved about the interview with Corey was that he was prepared. He was well-spoken. And one thing I love about his thoughts is when he goes up on that molehill, he's going to die up on that molehill. You feel what I'm saying? Like, he's like, look, this is because of my life and my experience. This is what I've been through. This is what works for me. You know, and just because you don't want to admit it, but you'll go do it. That's what he was basically saying to Cam. And it, like, you know what I mean? You don't want to admit it, but you'll go do it. You, know, you might not say, man, I might mess with a chick who, who doesn't make more money than me just because I can, you know, I control it a little bit better. Yeah, he's just being a lot more honest. He's honest. A lot of people do that. Yes. A lot of people do that shit, man. A lot of people do all kind of shit that we just was talking about Diddy. Yeah. If that shit could have stayed in the dark, you would have left it in the dark. Oh, yeah. Come on, People man. do what they want to they wanna fucking do. They just don't want to be judged for doing whatever they want to do. Right. Um, right. They want to be, um, be perceived as this great person, this great beloved person, right? Because that's what it is to be perceived as, right? Mm. If we was living in different times, you know what I mean. To be an asshole may be the way to be, right? And if you're perceived as that or a bad motherfucker, then like with Jordan, yeah. like with Michael Jordan in that yeah. uh in the Last Dance documentary, mm-hmm. people look at it like, oh man, he was a mean teammate, he was this and that, but hey, in this time I can do that. If he'd have did that in 2024, no lie, I really believe that. People will be like, and it's sad to say, but people will be looking at him different because it'd have been like, man, you can't talk to people like that. How you can get through the, you know what I mean? Even though he is great, 
but they'd have found a way to, you know, block him out in some kind of way. We think about we think about the, the level of, of the shit that was afforded to him, mm. right? Based off his ability. Yeah. Right. Not that's it. Just his ability. Not who he is or what he do. Just his ability. Just his ability to play ball. That's it. Or just his ability to sell music. Right. And then on top of that, the arrogance that he got from from reaping those financial benefits yeah. of being who he was. And everybody praising you. Right. Like, think about it, bro. You can be, you can be the most famous person in the world. You have all the influence, right? Yeah. At some point, if that, if it don't translate into dollars, shit don't matter. Right. It's gonna die down. But what dollars come, what financial freedom comes. Financial responsibility. You know, a sense of yourself. Oh, okay. Talk to me. Right. So the the more financial freedom you have, yeah, that's the, that that boasts who you really are. Mm. So you, you what you're saying is right to act. Exactly how you really are because okay. you, you're not dependent on anybody to do anything for you. So what you're saying is money makes you more of what you already are. Is what yes. you're saying, all right? Yes. If you was an asshole, yeah. you really was an asshole. You'll be even more. Money, <laughs> you're gonna be an asshole. Right. 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 If you was a, a kind person, you get some money, you still gonna be a kind person. Yeah. But some people are just kind because of the situations that they're in, mm. and they need these relationships to function. So they, they politic in the way you say right. they play the game, right. right? So when you play the game, right, you can only you can only be so much, you know what I'm saying? You, like, I, of what I, you I really are. Say, like, I, I, what's his name? Um, damn, I need a rapper. Uh oh, well, there's a lot of them. Vince Staples. Okay, okay, smart Vince brother, Staples smart said, brother. He said, uh, he said I can keep it real, but if I keep it too real, then y'all gonna you go hit me. Yeah, y'all gonna fire me. You know what I mean? So I can, I, I gotta find that line. Right. Of, of keeping it real to myself, but also functioning so I can maintain my, like, this cash flow that I need. Right. Right. Because you see it. Like, anybody that they feel, Malcolm X didn't say too much of anything wrong. Or Martin Luther King didn't say too much of anything wrong. Mm -hmm. Right? But these people was labeled as, as, um, as a domestic terrorist. Yeah. 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 When they was just championing for the for their people. Mm. Fred Hampton's too. Fred Hampton's of the world. The... Fred, Fred Hampton. Bro, every time I think about Fred Hampton. I, Young I, brother. I, I just think about, like, I feel like I'm not doing enough. Because mm. he did it so much at, at a young age. Son, at, at 27 years old, he was rallying people. He had uh the, the black practice he had the um it was doing breakfast, breakfast yeah it was it was like, serving the community serving bro community. yes like that, that shit is crazy for him at 24 25 years old mm. to just be able to lead like crazy. that so it is it is wild bro but it, it, a lot of it's scary too because think about it back then even with like uh you think about all those people who did do like sit-ins and all i, I don't want to get into it too much but like it, it's all a scary you know, especially when you once you know you just finally put your foot down and you don't know the outcome. But that goes back to what we was talking about. You don't know the consequence, but you know that okay, I'm standing on what I believe because of what I've been through. Right. You know what I'm saying? So I go back to Corey. Like Corey stood on what he believed because of what he'd been through, and it worked for him. And like you said, like you was talking about how it all ties back again. He says what he says. You know what I'm saying? But that's the reason why he's not into the. He's he's famous. You know, to us in the street, like you said, you can go to YouTube and go check out a Corey Holcomb, you know, and he's not going to have too many holds bars. Right. You know what I'm saying? But you can't go to uh, Warner Brothers Studio and check out a Corey Holcomb because, um, say, bro, we got sponsors. We got so much tied in. We don't know who's gay, who's straight, who's. But, I mean, that goes, that goes back into him, though, right? Like, right. You got you to gotta give him more of a, uh, you got to give him more grace. Not mm. really more grace. I'm going to say you got to give him more. More credit, okay, right? because he stands true to himself, right? All right, you know, you don't care about how people perceive him. You don't care about. You can't counsel somebody who don't give a fuck about being counseled. True. Yeah, and then like especially someone who has their own like a different way outside of the mainstream way of making money. So it's like it's hard to cancel somebody to be like like Kanye. People are like oh we'll cancel Kanye, but he has so many streams of income. Like, no, you don't know where the difference is, is, is between Kanye, right? Yeah, being canceled. Dave being canceled, right? Yeah. Dave Chappelle? 
Yeah, okay. Chappelle being canceled, right? Kanye was canceled, right? Yeah. His revenue quote. shrank significantly, right? Yeah, because he lost that. Yeah. Right. Because he had. He lost them deals. Yeah, he lost his deals. Lost the, like we said, talked about the connections, the money, talking yeah. crazy. We have sponsors, right. other people. And right. That showed you how much relationships matter, right? Yes. And it showed you who really fuck with you because think about it. You only see you only see who really loyal when you in, when when somebody has to fuck with you when nobody wants to fuck. Mm. That's when that's when that's when you know who's loyal. Mm, that was when deep. Not, when it's not convenient, or when they're gonna be vilified for fucking with you, and they still fuck with you, that's your that's your partner. Mm. You know what I mean? That was that that, that was a gym, nigga. That's a truth. That's a gym. Like to see who really go rock with you in your time of despair, your time of discomfort, your time of uh, of being out of out of uh, trend with everyone else is when you go truly see who rock. That's why I like what right Marlon now. Wayans was saying. Okay. Oh, right now. Watching it with oh, who really rock with him? Right Man, now. people still rock with him. Right now, I'm just saying, like you see how many people, like all of them companies and stuff, they they threw him to the side. You're not fucking with him. Yeah. You know what I mean? All of his relationships, all of the people that was at his party, not nobody said, "Well, I was at that party." You know what I'm saying? Yeah. A lot of these motherfuckers was in his mad face and capitalized off capitalizing yes. off off the parties, networking. Right. Yes, Puff was the man. Right. Granted. That some of the they, they didn't have to stay for all of that shit. Right. But, but once upon a time, everybody was raving to go to these parties. Yes. Or just to even be around Puff. Right. But now nobody wanna be around with him, nobody wanna be associated with him. It's just that's just to show how quick the tide can turn. Right. And everybody knew about all this, this and that, this, this right. and that, but you still was in his face right. and now, trying to do business with him. Not as mad in a, in, a, in a position to uh, be looking around thinking. Where my real friends at when I really need them. Yeah. Mm-hmm. At least he still got like a hundred something million. You know, he still got that's cool he still got a bag. Gone, yeah, it can't, but man, I'd be like, nigga, I'd be like, man, nigga, look, put 250 on my books every every R. month. Kelly. <laughs> Praise R. Kelly. Man, R. Kelly, R. Kelly can't he went to jail, bro. Yeah. They fucked up his whole income. Yeah, he went to prayer yeah, when he got convicted. I think <clears throat> see, I agree. I think that's wrong. Even though he did what he did. He still made the music he made, so he still should. As long as people are still streaming yeah, it, he should I still get paid it. off of it, in my opinion. But regardless of that, right? Yeah. Regardless of that, right? If he owns all this shit, he get that share no matter what. Right. Right. Now he's in a position to where he can't pay his bills because he's here, right? Right. Granted, granted that that he's there on his own doing. What's his, his, his bills? Right. <laughs> And get commissary, nigga. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like, like, but no, like all of the money that he owes, yeah, he's not generating no new income, so he's okay. not making enough money to to keep his house to do the upkeep on his on his properties because he's in jail. Right? Oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You see how many so years they get that nigga? Got, Shit. He got, he got, he still gotta pay. You know, yeah, his outside affairs. Pay his shit. Yeah, but he I'm, can't generate no income. Shit, the years they get that nigga shit, he need to he need to pay somebody to cut the jailhouse line because he gonna beat up. I know what you mean. Right. I know what you mean. Like even the shit with um, what what um, uh, which one? Harvey Weinstein, you know, Je- Jeffrey Epstein. You know, that juice. Okay, okay. Juice had to pay restitution. And like OJ. Most of, yeah, most of his um uh, his, his estate were went to uh the uh the victims. The victims. Right. When he wasn't convicted guilty. Right, but they beat him in civil court. That's how they got. That's what I'm saying. Like, which is crazy. How you can you don't convict me in murder in criminal court, but you convict me of murder in civil court, which is crazy. Crazy. And now I owe you money. I owe you money for the rest of my life. But it's going now. The juice is the juice was spilled. You know what I'm saying? But God cleaning it up now. A lot of people didn't like that how he came out. When he came out, he had a big nest egg to come to. Oh yeah, yes. Yeah, bro, it's still OJ. Like he's famous for being a murderer. Regardless or of t- allegedly. Well, allegedly. I'm not gonna say he was he was found free, from what I understand. You know what but people say he's a win, because simply he was. You know what I mean? Like you know, Craig, criminally he was found. Criminally, he was not, innocent. Civilly, yeah, civilly, yeah, yeah civilly he was found. Yeah. So, how how you sue somebody like that on civil charges? Like I don't know, because back in the day it was a wild time. So we yeah, we, we like, were still setting presidents. I'm suing you because you killed him. Yeah, but the, 
The court said I was court said I didn't kill him. Right. So, and the thing so, is, even if he did admit it, you can't bring him back up because it'd be double jeopardy. No, like, you want my money because you said I killed the man that this court just proved that I, I killed didn't him. kill. Right. The glove didn't quit, so they acquitted. I mean, the glove didn't fit, so they acquitted. Like, I agree. That's what I'm saying. Like, it, it bro, like, we, we, we can go back on all type of stuff that probably happened in the 80s, and 70s, 80s, and 90s, bro. And we would blow, it would blow our mind, but they were able to get away with it because there wasn't no, uh, the news got to choose what they wanted to blast out, what they wanted to put out. Oh, okay, somebody got wrongfully convicted here. We don't matter. Let's put these, let's put this story out because it sounds better. You feel what I'm saying? And, and, and that's the time we live. That's the time we was living in. Even now, like you have to fight to get the truth out of news publications and, you know, and, you know, things around them. The lie is more entertaining than the truth, so you're gonna run with it. Yeah, yeah. Like, the whole, the whole thing. Like, I don't know if you remember when Trump got elected. Like he was saying, that's alternative facts. Yeah, yeah. He what ran on that. What the fuck is an alternative fact? See, it, it, when, when it's in his favor, it works. When it's out of his favor, oh, it's fake news. You know what I'm saying? Was, but what the fuck is an alternative fact? I don't know. That's a. Can we? I, I gotta break that down before we get up out of here. It's a fact. But it's the alternative of a, of a fact. Which means it's what? A fact. If you say, <laughs> what's the alternative fact? Like it's the opposite side of a fact. So it's like, so it's like, okay. It's another fact. It's another shoe. So those are not green shoes. Those are blue shoes. But the fact is it's still shoes. Hey, no, the fact is those are still shoes. Mm, and oh. So they're green. Bluish. But it's a bluish green, but it still is more comfortable. Mm, blue than green. So if I say this was blue, like nah, I'm gonna tell you this was green. You know what? That's what we're gonna name this episode. Alternative facts. Yeah. <laughs> Appreciate y'all, man. Listen, listen, we just wanted to get y'all in here. Like I said, it's been a minute, you know what I mean? We have been just chopping out shit, up talking out shit. I know y'all miss us. We miss y'all, you know. Come here. Show me some love. Come here, girl. Like comment, subscribe, you know what I mean? Share the shit. Tell a friend. Tell a friend to all of us. You know what I mean? Any any little bit counts, you know? And like like my boy said, until next time. Woo!